Hey there do-it-yourself technicians. Today I want to talk to you about document scanning and a mobile app that I use, Scannable. Scannable is from the Evernote family, but it works just as well without Evernote as well. Basically it allows you to scan any document into your phone by placing it down on a nice contrasting surface and taking a picture of it. The great thing is you don't need to be picky about how you take your photo because Scannable actually fixes a lot of issues for you. Let's take a look. Here I'm scanning three different documents. A letter from our local federal member of parliament. One of those tiny little instruction manuals that you get with things and then seem to lose all the time. And a receipt for a purchase of some sort. This is the dark grey carpet that I have on the floor of my office. And it provides a really nice contrasting background to the white pages. You can see how Scannable finds the edges of the document and then straightens it up into a nice neat rectangle and removes most of the distortions at the same time. If it finds the document is mostly text, it will then colour correct it to make the text more readable. Now that we have the document in Scannable, there's quite a few things we can do with it as well. With the tap of a button, we can restore the colours to see if the colour version was actually any more easy to see. In this case, no, I'm going back to the enhanced version. We can change the document type that it saves to, from PDF to an image file and back again, which will depend on what it is that you actually want to do with it. And you can also change the name of the file that it's going to be saved as. Because this has been captured as a multi-page document, you can actually go and reorder the pages in case something went wrong. Or you can delete pages with just a tap or a flick. Now we're just down to the instruction manual. I can name it and then save it to the camera roll of this phone. I can also save it directly to Evernote from here, which makes sense because it's an Evernote product. One of the great things is that Evernote will actually go through and do an optical character recognition check on this document over the next few days. What that means is I can go in later and search for one of the words that's in this document and it will pop up in the search list and highlight that word in the document. Really handy for finding things again which you can't always do with just a plain photo. I can either share it either directly by email or using any of the standard iPhone sharing options available, be it AirDrop, text, mail, Facebook, Messenger, pretty much anything. Obviously this is the iPhone version, but there is an Android version as well and it works basically exactly the same. Now, it's not the sort of app that you use every day, but it's really handy for archiving little bits of paper that are kept lying around especially when combined with Evernote and the search capability. Can you see yourself using Scannable? Let me know in the comments down below. The Tech Doctor exists to help you become your own technician and navigate your technology maze. We release episodes every weekend and you can see some old ones here and here. And if you subscribe with the subscribe button down here, you'll actually be notified each time a new episode is released. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day.